Once again, you are welcome to the ultimate voyage through the fabric of human existence. Culture Scarps Trekking Join us as we take you on an exciting journey through times, revealing the secrets of the past, present, and even the mysterious passageways of prehistoric times. As we go across the cosmos and explore the core of human history, culture, and existence, I'm ecstatic to be your guide. The Low Communities Journey Clans, Guided crucial role in Shege Royal, triggered by internal conflicts among Nai Kongo, Demo, and Philo, unfolded a chapter of separation and assimilation. As the various sub groups charted their paths, Intermingling with other communities and absorbing diverse cultural elements, the Lua narrative became a mosaic of traditions. The Southern Luo, with roots in fishing, agriculture, underwent a two of assimilation to Luo culture. Interfeeding into Luo culture, heritage added layers to the multifaceted Luo story. The Joe Kowango Sub Emerging from interactions with Luyas Traversed a journey from western Kenya to Saya Embodying the complex dynamics of Lu migration The Kizuru Luos Originally a Bantu ethnic group with linguistic similarities to the Guzi people Found common ground with the Lutherindi, the Seretati, the Vivinur Sapulfaishan, and the Luoishi, Abalia community, and the Imboluos, originally a minority Bantu, speaking group in Yimbo, further enriched the diverse Lua narrative. The Lua's political unity and cultural bloc encounters with indigenous populations distinguished them as a politico cultural bloc in Kenya. Their settlement on the northeastern shores of Lake Victoria, while not a conquest, reflects a gradual integration of both Karish and Tantantate. Testament to Kenya's vibrant cultural mosaic. The Luo history, a testament to resilience and adaptation, unfolds in seven major sections, each with its unique origin story. The Ramaji Luos, led by the warrior elder Ramaji Ajwang, embarked on a migration around Years ago, settling initially at Gat Ramoji, Ramoji Hills, in Yimbo before traversing South Nyanza and North Migration, namely Joe, Kawani Joe, Kawani Joe, Kawani Joe, Ha, the Luyas formed the Tariki ethnic group in the western region before entering Saya. The Dairango Luas, while maintaining some Bantu ethnic group, became intertwined with Luos, originally a Bantu group related to the Abagusi community, integrated with the Lua through intermarriage, adopting Daluo and becoming part of the broader Lua community. Arrived in north of the Moak land and to the Banyar Sahed of other Sadavalar city of the origin. Imbo Luos, a minority Bantu, speaking group, initially inhabited Yimbo, later forming the Ajwando with distinct groups. Lastly, the other Luos, or Nyoko, represent minority Luo adoptees, clans absorbed into the Luo community through infiltration. 
The intricate relationships between these sections highlight a history shaped by migrations, cultural exchanges, and assimilations. The Luo people's ability to maintain unity despite diverse ancillaries, Kenya, with minor distinctions between the Alego, Virginia Gem locality, known as the Trans Yala dialect, and the standard Dalio dialect spoken by the rest of the Luo people. The convergence of Melodic and Bantu populations. Within the Luo community, reinforces their unity as a single ethnic group, embracing diverse ancestry while remaining a cohesive entity. The narrative reflects not only the past, but only the past, but only the Dominski. Dominski, the Luo people together. Transcending time and contributing to the rich mosaic of Kenya's diverse heritage, dating back centuries, the stories and traditions of the peoples of Kenya are some of the most fascinating in the world. They have enriched the country through social, economic, political, and cultural activities, each with their own unique stories. Today, communities are officially recognized by the government and are classified into three linguistic groups: the national linguistic groups, communities, which represent the country's ethnic diversity and vibrant cultures. Many of the cultural practices are still embraced today, but have been influenced by the changes in society. This exhibit celebrates the country as rich heritage through the Luo community. The Luo are the fourth largest ethnic group in Kenya. They speak Dalio, which is part of the Nilotic language group. Notable Luos include the former Prime Minister of Kenya, Raila Odinga. Of the United States of America, Barack Obama, and the environmental scientist and Nobel Prize winner, Professor Sam Odingo. The Luo are a Nilotic-speaking group who are believed to have originated from Sudan. And are now settled around the Lake Victoria Basin in Kenya and Tanzania. Other Luo groups are found in Uganda, Congo, Ethiopia, and Sudan. The Luo people's intricate connection and honey hunters were fabricated into the fabric of the Dedelis practices. The mano plant used to create fishing traps. Stands as a symbol of resourcefulness, embodying the Lu belief that the trap never goes without catching fish. Their agricultural adaptation, influenced by fertile soils and abundant rainfall, marks a transition from pastoralism to farming. The Lu's connection to the land extends beyond sustenance. Embracing the spiritual, the legend of Luanda Mhembo, associated with natural, a water, all the water, rock encapsulates the mystical dimensions woven into Luo narratives. The cultural heartbeat of the Luo resonates through their traditional music. A vibrant tapestry of drums, rattles, horns, and stringed instruments like the nati. These musical expressions serve not only as entertainment but as conduits for spiritual invocation, rain dances, and healing rituals. The abutral eternal instrument made of gourds emanates in every every note. 
Centering every kidney cell out. Removal of six front teeth are more than cultural markers. They embody a heritage of resilience and endurance. The Lewis historical journey from Sudan to their settlements along the River Nile reflects the ebb and flow of civilizations marked by calamities, conflicts, and cultural assimilation. The nuances of their origin, from Tikiti to Khartoum, resonate as echoes from a distant past. The Lewis encounter with dark-skinned people in South Sudan, leading to the, the name Joe, Alu, Ayah, Hans.